loves to smell things. She loves to chase cats. She loves her chew bones. She she gets happy to see me when I come in at the end of the day. So this is Lily. Lily came to me August 30th. She is a survivor of the illegal dog meat trade. Um, it's an illegal um, trade that goes on in Thailand and some of the surrounding areas where they smuggle dogs into Vietnam for their meat. Um, sometimes these are people's pets. Sometimes they're just street dogs. Um, I adopted Lily through a foundation called the Soy Dog Foundation. Soy, S-O-I, Dog Foundation. Soy is, is um, means street dog in Thai. She has lost the use of her feet and hind legs due to her spinal cord injury as a result of her capture. Um, these dogs are smuggled into Vietnam, but before they're transported, they're literally crushed into cages and oftentimes their bones are broken and sometimes they even suffocate um, because so many cages are stacked and um, they're just literally crushed into these cages and, and that's how Lily um, lost the use of her legs. Lily never made the trip to Vietnam, thankfully, but she suffered these injuries in the cages when they captured her. These are socks for dogs. Um, they're not meant to be cute, although they kind of are cute. <laughs> uh, because Lily can't walk, she drags her hind legs. And when she does, she's susceptible to what they call pressure wounds. And um, so we put these on her feet to protect her feet from the pressure wounds. The Soy Dog Foundation, um, they stop as many of these trucks as they can from getting into Vietnam, and, and Lily is a survivor. And um, I'll tell you, she gives me a lot more than I give her. I love her.